The Hawkeyes looking to reign unbeaten this Saturday when they host Northern Iowa. Their 2-0 record hasn't been without some issues, particularly on offense with quarterback Nate Stanley and the passing game. I caught up with Stanley and the Hawkeyes earlier this week about the subject. The start to Nate Stanley's junior season hasn't gone according to plan. He looks like he's pressing to me a little bit. The Hawks quarterback has thrown for just 274 yards and one touchdown for an offense that's failed to find consistency through two games. Just need to capitalize on some of the opportunities that, that we have had. Um, you know, it's nothing special. Kirk Ferentz says Stanley might be trying to be too perfect. You know, you can't aim a ball. I know that when you throw something. So, you know, I think he's doing a little bit of that right now. Just going to keep working at There's no, you know pixie dust or, you know, pill we give a guy or something like that. It's just, you know, working through it and developing confidence. Really just try to make those plays that could, could spring into long runs or, or uh, you know, long pass plays and just be a little more consistent with, uh, you know, the makeable plays, you know, the consistent plays that are, that are, you know, the same week in and week out. Stanley admits it's been tough to handle some of the higher expectations after last year's breakout campaign, but he says the coaches have remained consistent with their message throughout his early season struggles. There's always, you know, a little anxiety that comes with the level of performance that people think you should be at. Um, but, you know, the message hasn't, ch hasn't changed. Really just try to, you know, relax and, and, and go out there and have fun. That message is consistent across the unit. Receiver Nick Easley is confident that Stanley and the offense are close to breaking out. I know Nate, I know the guys around us, uh, you know, we all have the ability to, to execute well and execute at a high level. Um, we just need to get out there and get clicking and we'll be fine. All right, Northern Iowa could be a good opponent for Stanley in the passing game to get back on track. Panthers allowed 273 yards and two touchdowns through the air in their season opening loss. Kickoff at Kinnick Stadium, 6.30 p.m. on Saturday night on the Big Ten Network.